every decade adds its unique touch to Christmas culture and history. From the classic Christmas music from the 40s and 50s to the aluminum trees of the 1960s. But in terms of sheer volume of enduring pop culture, no decade comes close to the 1980s. Nothing gets you into the Christmas spirit quite like a little Christmas music, and the 1980s had its fair share. Islands in the Stream duo Dolly Parton and Kenny Rogers released Once Upon a Christmas in 1984, and also starred in a Christmas special called A Christmas to Remember. Also that year, the charity supergroup Band-Aid gave us Do They Know It's Christmas, which became the biggest selling single ever. And finally, 1987 brought us the first hip-hop Christmas song with Run DMC's Christmas and Hollis. The song was also included in the movie Die Hard, which made it even more popular. The 1980s had so much variety in Christmas music from all genres, making it a unique departure from more traditional songs. In the 80s, the shopping mall was the central hub for all things Christmas. Not only was it brimming with shoppers, but it was also decorated from top to bottom, making it a perfect time to wait in line and sit on Santa Claus's lap. This also gave many parents time to sample selections from Hickory Farms while they waited. The 1980s is when mass hysteria over the must-have toys of the season began. This is also the time when Toys R Us became a retail juggernaut, with many kids trading in the Sears catalog for the Toys R Us dream book to pick out the things they wanted from Santa. Let's face it, when we think about Christmas in the 1980s, our minds go to the toys of the time. Who remembers the lines to get a Cabbage Patch Kid? Or maybe the other top toys of the decade, like a Rubik's Cube, Teddy Ruxpin, Transformers, a Nintendo Entertainment System, or even a Big Wheel. All of these things were at the top of every kid's wish list, and it made for an exciting Christmas morning waiting and wondering if you were going to get that one thing you desperately wanted. The lead up to the big day still saw kids watching the classic animated shows from earlier decades, but many of their favorite shows also began airing Christmas specials. From a He-Man and She-Ra Christmas special to ones from Garfield, Alf, The Muppets, and Pee Wee Herman. There was no lack of options when it came to TV programming. On the big screen, the 1980s continued to contribute to pop culture, with holiday favorites like A Christmas Story, Santa Claus the Movie, Scrooged, and National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation. These films, along with many more, would lay the groundwork for the many marathons that would become a staple of modern cable television. There were also many memorable TV movies that were quintessential 1980s, including The Night They Saved Christmas, a Smoky Mountain Christmas, and a very Brady Christmas. From shopping for gifts to spending time at home watching movies, the Christmas season was still about spending time with the ones we loved. The traditions and memories made during this time are what make us yearn for that feeling again. Christmas in the 1980s was a special time, especially if you were a kid who received a Nintendo in 1985. If you have your own memories or traditions of Christmas, 
I would love for you to share them in the comments. Please enjoy this remaining photo album from the past of Christmas during the 1980s.